Hey vegans in the wild over 50. So this is my first haul with my full camper. I brought her here empty and made trips from my apartment. So I'm very sure I'm much overweight. Um, so I'm just gonna take it easy, getting to my next stop, which I just saw, I missed a call from them. This is my first time traveling with one of these back things, but I did find the straps, so that was really good. And lights are all working. I haven't tried the directions or anything, but I'll be fine, I'll try them now. This coupler, I think it's called. Um, I need to pull forward because it's almost going down, but just not quite. I also need new chains welded on. And I my car top carrier. Take a quick look inside cat dog. I fastened the seatbelt behind that heavy bin, so at least it's not gonna be glaring at me the whole time like it was on the way here. And yeah, so this is chock full and I got rid of so much. So the dinette goes down. I was told I'm supposed to drive with it down. So I put it down, close, 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 close. Um, I took everything off that front shelf and put it in the bins and the same with the counter. I folded the bed back, it, it like slides out for stabilization and I put that back in. Um, the refrigerator has a little chain to keep it closed. That stuff up there is very lightweight, so I didn't bother taking it down. These cupboards close, but the front two cupboards that they did don't don't shut. So I just have to fingers crossed on those. And I think I'll bring my puff vest so I don't look like I just rolled out of the woods. I need a new air conditioner because I'm not even going to turn that on. It's too scary looking. All right, so fingers crossed everything works. I'm just going to pull forward a little bit, fix my coupler before I go. I did lights and front lock and now I'll lock this and that'll be good to go. See you next stop. Bye Colorado River Thousand Trails. I'll miss you. I can't wait to come back.